welcome to the unboxing of CSP Air Robot Respirator. Now I got it uh, from uh, Amazon for about, uh, it was highly discounted, so I got it for about 300 euros. So let's now do the unboxing of it. First, I want to apologize for my haircut, but I guess it's a sign of current times, as is this video also, I guess. And also, subtitles are available, if you can't fully comprehend my accent. But, without further ado, let's dive into it. Now, this is a take three, so box has already been opened. Third time was a bit easier actually. It's still pretty tight, but I guess that's the good thing. Now, this is the inside uh, of this box. And first thing to pop out is the hood. This is the thing that goes on your head. The second thing to pop out is the main device. And this is actually much heavier than I, I thought it would be. Then uh, we have power adapter to charge it with different different uh, plugs. So for the European plug, I think it has whatever these plugs are, I don't know. Uh, it's, it's made in UK, so one is UK plug. But it does come with different plugs and it says input 100 to 240 volts. So I guess it works in America also. That's, that's good to know. And last but not least, we have um, this is a tester uh, for the airflow. So you put it on top of the machine, and then if it blows it to the green part, then you have enough airflow. If it's on the red part, then you probably need to change the filter. It has been already gotten too much. Uh, with uh, particle filters, they over time they don't uh, degrade in, in a sense, but they, they even become a little bit better filters. Uh, but uh, it's because there is more dust uh, gathering in it, airflow is going to be more and more restricted. So at some point, you know, not enough air is going to go through the filter. You need to buy a new filter. By the way, this one has a combination filter of uh, gas and um, uh, particles. Uh, one thing to notice also is there is a, a motor for the cache and there is a motor for the particles. The motor for the gas is more powerful one and can take either gas filter or the combination filter which, which I have on here. The motor uh, uh, for parti particles can only take particle filter. Uh, so you need to buy the same uh, type of filter than you buy the machine. So, two types of machines, three types of filters. If you have the particle uh, machine, then you only buy the particle filters. If you have uh, the gas machine, then you either buy the gas uh, filter or the combination filter, which is gas plus particles. So, I, I haven't tested uh, if the particle filter goes to this also, the pure particle filter which is the cheapest actually, but they say that you need to just buy the same type of filter as the machine is. And obviously if you want to protect yourself from the current times, you need particle filter. So you say you have a particle mach machine and you buy the particle filter, or yeah, actually it does come with a filter. Or uh, you have the gas machine and then you, you need a uh, combination filter. Particles plus gas. 
Okay, let's look at the wood. By the way, there is more uh, information on the description of the video, so feel free to read it if something is not understandable. Let's take the hood out. So, you have the hood with the, uh, what is it called in English? I can't remember, but you understand what I mean, sir. So. Thank you. Uh, so, let's put the hood on. Huh. Now, uh, you might see this hood is quite uh, foggy, but uh, because it's because I haven't uh, taken off the protective film yet. Which I will do later, but <laughs> since it's already a third uh, try on the unpacking, then uh, yeah, I, 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 I'll leave it for later. Now the hood, I feel it's a little bit too tight on my, on my neck here. It's not like it's gonna be strangling me, but it's not um, not comfortable. But let's see if I can do something about it. Now, think about the hood, I also discovered that it is possible to take away, to, you know, to unscrew this thing here. So I could, you know, theoretically make my own hood that fits me better and, uh, like, you can, like, you see, you can remove it. Rem you remove it, but I'm not gonna do it right now, but you could, you could make your own hood theoretically. That fits you better, which I am gonna going to do later. Now let me just park it on my head first for the lack of better place. Uh, and let's go on to the main machine. Now we have a manual on the same box as the, as the same bag uh, as the main machine, so you can read. And let's get it the machine. Now, it comes already filter installed, so this is a gas machine that has a combination filter, so it's a gas part and a particle part are close here. And this is a place where, uh, where uh, the hood connects. Okay? Oh. As is well. Oh. Yeah. It takes take a little bit of practice, but yeah, easy enough. Uh, okay. And usually you wear on your back, but since I'm planning to like take go to an airplane with it, I'm gonna put it on my belly. Now since I'm pretty fat, I I had to adjust the strap a little bit, but at least it is adjustable so uh, let me let me see how it is now i feel quite pregnant i would say <laughs> so it's it's it it, it, it weighs a bit about the same as a baby i guess uh, on uh, i don't know six months or something so i guess if you wanna if you wanna experience that then also Good opportunity. Now let me just connect everything up and see how it, how it is. Okay. Oh, this machine should. Well, I'm not going to st uh, start it because it it ne first needs to uh, charge for uh, 14 hours, but it hasn't been charging, so I'm not going to connect it. Uh, I'm not going to. I'm not gonna turn it on right now yet, but uh, yeah, this is how it is. No, what we ah, what I did not didn't show it. This one goes. Um, 
Yep. This one goes on top of, yeah, like this. This one goes on top of here. And then uh, I can uh, see how much it rises and if it's in the green or do I need to replace the filter. So the filters are like, for this are about 40 to 50 pounds if in port in England. So I guess, I don't know, 50, 60 euros, something like that. And as I said, maybe one, you can put uh, uh, the cheap particle, 20 pound particle filter on it also, just, just a particle filter, but uh, they are not telling that you can do it. So I guess if you feel it adventurous and you can try it out. Okay, so a quick little addition. I want to show you first how to remove uh, the fitter. A little bit pushing down and then turning, like I said. Uh, and yeah, so like we see, this part is uh, this is a combination filter. This part here is uh, activated carbon, and this part here is like you can see uh, the particle particle filter. Now let's put it back, and actually I'm gonna put it turn it on uh, because it turns out well, since it is a nickel metal hydride battery. Uh, they uh, advise it to run it completely empty before uh, starting to charge it because nickel metal hydride batteries can have a memory effect. Which means it's better to do full cycles with them, meaning run it completely flat and then charge it uh, completely and then run it completely flat. It's, it's the best for the health of the battery. Where is, uh, Lithium batteries, it doesn't matter. So, okay, first we can get this, okay, push, then, yeah. Uh, so we are gonna shoot it on and see how it feels like. Oh, it's, uh, more uh, in depth video will come later, but let's do a, do a simple, simple test run of it. Okay. Okay, let's put it on and let's do it on. Yeah. Ah. Okay. I wish it was a little bit quieter, but I think I can be with the sound, especially if uh, let me just try it and put it. Behind me, yeah. I, I think I, I think I can. I think it works. I see. I think maybe the other, other one, um, the particle only one is since it's less uh, powerful, maybe it's a less um, less noisy. Also, I don't know. A video I saw it, 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 it sounded less noisy, but. So as you can see, my head is filling up. <laughs> so this is a, it, it's like it has a 180 liters a minute. So I feel a little bit. I did feel a little bit, a little bit cold. Maybe I should. If it's if it's a cold weather, I, I probably should have a, put something on my head underneath of it because it's kind of blowing in my blowing uh, in my uh, back back of my head but anyhow this is this is how it works thank you again and have a good one